The Malta Business Bureau has been working on energy efficiency for business since 2014, when the Energy Efficiency Directive came into force. Over the years, the MBB developed an ecosystem of energy services. The system focused on supporting policy drives and the 2020 targets by promoting increased energy efficiency measures in business. From supporting the National Authority, the Energy and Water Agency's voluntary agreement on energy efficiency with businesses, to our flagship best practice dissemination project, the Investing in Energy, our focus has been to disseminate and address barriers to take up of energy efficiency best practice. Throughout these years, Malta has always strived to achieve its energy efficiency and renewables targets. Among the leading sectors were the industrial and services sector. In 2019, they generated an increase in gross value added of circa 8.9%, whilst only increasing their consumption with 3%. The Malta Business Bureau approached Deloitte to help identify and implement financial mechanisms that can assist our businesses to become more energy efficient. Over the recent years, LAPAC has invested heavily in energy, both from a consumption and generation standpoint. Energy efficiency is one of the areas where we at Delarue strive to continuously improve on. The first thing we did was have a look at the technical and financial data that the Malta Business Bureau collected in this regard. Data which indeed showed that there is a financing gap that needs to be addressed. In 2014, we completed an 830 kilowatt peak solar farm installation installing over 3,200 panels. The system generates approximately 65% of the whole company's energy and will consumption. As non-SME members of the MBB's business energy cluster, we were invited to share our design, knowledge and experience implementing this project with other businesses. One of our latest initiatives involved an in-house designed and built cooling systems where we combined an underground reservoir as a heating together with a series of heat exchangers to save a significant amount of energy and the related CO2 emissions into our process water. We look forward to continue contributing towards Malta's renewable energy generation targets and energy efficiency targets. We were in advanced discussions with stakeholders pre-COVID and we are confident that once the crisis subsides, momentum on this initiative will return.